school has seen a dramatic change in its results following the government's U-turn on grading. 84% of students at Wales High School in Rotherham have had one or more of their original results upgraded. The head teacher here has described the government's handling of the issue as nothing short of a fiasco. Mark Ansell has more. Kieran has gone from a C in physics to an A following the government's A-level grades U-turn. It means he can go to his first choice university of Newcastle rather than Coventry. Kieran is one of 84% of year 13s at Wales High School in Rotherham who have seen their grades go up. I was at work at the time so I had my phone set up on my desk watching the news live. Um, and then when they announced it, I shouted, and all my all my colleagues turned around. They're like, "What? What? What is it?" So I told them, and they were all pleased for me. And then my mum phoned me up straight after, and she went, "Ah!" And squealed down the phone, um, and everybody heard it. Everyone was laughing. I, it was just a really, really happy moment. Eleanor is heading to the University of York to study archaeology. She's worried about friends who may have missed out on a place at uni despite now achieving the entry grades. It's four days late, this is the problem, you know, you've had four days for everyone else to get in and anyone who, you know, people who have places, they've been denied that now, they're going to have to probably state their insurance, it's up to the universities, so they're kind of unsure what's going to happen. Her teacher Pepe Diasio felt a sense of relief following the government U-turn, but that has turned to anger. It's nothing short of a fiasco the way it's been led and managed over the last uh, few weeks. Uh, the government have known about the potential for this happening for several weeks now and done nothing about it. And I'm just happy uh, that students are able to get the grades that they are worth uh, and, and grades that will help them move on to the next stage in their, their careers and their learning. Kieran and Eleanor now step out into the world with the grades they feel they deserve. Mark Ansell, BBC Look North, Wales in Rotherham.